Hey, what's up, guys? Buzzsaw Gaming here. Hanging out with Mr. Buzzsaw in his shark costume. <laughs> in the background, we've got Enemy Zero playing on the Sega Saturn on the 27 inch Sony Triniton CRT. Absolutely awesome. It's such a 1990s intro. <laughs> Anyways, guys, here to bring you the Mega Sega Saturn pickup video. Yay! <laughs> Mr. Buzzsaw is super pumped, as you can tell. Super excited for Sega Saturn this morning. <laughs> guys, I went crazy with Sega Saturn last month. I bought eight games. So... Got them in different ways. Want to kind of share that with you. Kind of go over my experience. First, I'll start with these two right here. Enemy Zero. Absolutely awesome. I love it. It's one of my new favorite games right now. Oh, Mr. Bussa on the move. It's basically part of the D series. If you know the original D, and then you got uh, D2. Oh. <laughs> Mr. Bussa metamorphosizing coming out of his shark costume <laughs> anyways enemy zero <laughs> it's survival horror it's part of the D series you got the original D on Sega Saturn you got D2 on Dreamcast which I do have it's an awesome survival horror game and you got enemy zero here which is basically survival horror uh, on a uh, spaceship and it's really creepy, really cool. I'm getting into it. I really like it. The trick about it, Enemy Zero, you don't see the enemy. You have this little Geiger counter that kind of uh, shows you where the enemy is. And it's really cool. Kind of reminds me of uh, Alien Isolation, something like that. Really cool game. Super retro. Absolutely love it. Guardian Heroes. This is awesome, too. Absolutely awesome. I mean, I got a super minty copy of Guardian Heroes. It's really cool. Awesome beat em up. I love this kind of like um, cartoonish type graphics. Really fun beat em up. Such a good time as well. I love these Sega Saturn boxes. I mean, they're massive. They're so cool. <laughs> and down here we've got, I put these down like this so you can see them better. Night Warriors, Dark Stalker's Revenge. Now this is cool. This is my favorite fighter right now on Sega Saturn. Absolutely awesome. Uh, you can actually play as Bigfoot, as Sasquatch. So how cool is that? I mean, you got, uh, you can beat up on people as Sasquatch. So I love the graphics of this thing. I mean, it's just, these 2D, like really, you know, chunky, big 2D graphics is something that Sega Saturn is, you know, specializes in. I really like it. I think they did an awesome, awesome job. Really cool game. Die Hard Arcade. Super cheesy. Super fun. Absolutely awesome. I love it. It's just over the top. Uh, Die Hard Arcade and Enemy Zero. I actually picked up in a store when I was traveling. So I went into this retro store and they had a, actually had a bunch of Saturn games. And, but the only two I was inter interested in was Enemy Zero and Die Hard Arcade. I mean, Enemy Zero has like the plastic, you know, protector case over it. It's super minty. It's got a bunch of discs in it, like four discs, I think, something like that. It's an awesome game. Die Hard Arcade, also super cool. Uh, I bought both. I wanted to film the whole thing, but they wouldn't allow Mr. Buzzsaw in. So unfortunately, I wasn't able to film the actual physical pickup, but... Uh, yeah, I got a pretty good deal, I think. I mean, considering these are they're pricey games, I got a decent deal. And yeah, absolutely awesome. So much fun. I mean, Die, Card Arca uh, Die Hard Arcade is uh, it's just cheesy. It's fun. It's one of the better games on the Saturn. It's really up my alley. I think it's an awesome, awesome game. So cool. Darius Gaiden. Really cool shooter on the Saturn 2D. Awesome, awesome graphics. It's got the fish theme. It's got these giant like fish robots. <laughs> I mean, it's really cool. It's an awesome game. Good soundtrack. Uh, yeah, I like it. I like it. It's an awesome, awesome game as well. Super fun. 
Of course, I had to get the original Panzer Dragoon. I got Panzer Dragoon 2, Zwei already. So I had to pick up the original as well. Got this one here, Minty Fresh. It's an awesome game as well. So I got two of the three of the series. No, I'm not getting a third one. It's just absolutely ridiculous in price. So I think I'm just going to stick to just these two. And uh, yeah, the original Panzer Dragoon. Back there where Mr. Buzzsaw is metamorphosizing, I've got Nights Into Dreams. And a nice minty copy again of Nights Into Dreams. That is a funky, funky game. I just, I don't know what to make of it yet. I still can't understand it. So you kind of start and you're walking around. You got to walk this one part and you, you transform into this flying thing, I guess. And you kind of fly around and do backflips and go through coins and different things. And you have a time limit. So, and when you, if you don't uh, finish on time, it says the night's over. <laughs> so yeah, it's an unusual game. Uh, I need to play more of it for sure. And Virtual Fighter 2, right there. That's one of the famous games on the Sega Saturn. It's really cool. It's got those mid 90s uh you know chunky graphics it's super cool i really like it i dig it of course you got the sega saturn uh model 2 controller i love it mr buzzsaw relaxing right there on the 3d controller also very awesome got my black sega saturn right there but yeah guys i mean these are the pickups as far as uh where i got them i mean two of them like i said i got them directly from uh a retro store I really wish they would have let me film with Mr. Buzzsaw. Even the, uh, the assistant manager, I talked to her. She's like, oh, I really like Bearded Dragons. It would be really cool. I'd like to have you film and all that. But it just, I don't know. There's some kind of weird ordinances with uh, with animals in a lot of places where they won't let you in. The same thing with the Portland Retro Gaming Expo. I was going to go. I even contacted the, uh, the people who host it. And they just won't allow... Uh, it's actually the convention center, the Oregon Convention Center. They just won't allow animals that are not, um, uh, I guess, for handicap purposes. So it's the way it goes, the way the cookie crumbles, guys. So anyways, let me know what you think of the Mega Sega Saturn's pickup. I think I'm pretty much done with Sega Saturn for right now. I mean, my bank account is hurting too much from this. So I'm going to go through these games and and play them and enjoy them. I mean, so far, I really, I really like them all. I mean, none of them's a dud. They're all really good, high quality games. I mean, I really like Enemy Zero because it's so unique. Garden Heroes is so awesome. Die Hard Arcade, I love. I mean, Night Warriors, I like the, the graphics. It's so cool. Darius Gaiden with the fish theme. I mean, it's, it's just a lot of cool stuff here. It's gonna take me a long time to get through it, so. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for checking out the video. If you had a good time, put a lizard emoji down below. Uh, you know, put down a comment or two. I always answer all comments. I always look forward to talking with you guys. And, uh, yeah, talking about Sega Saturn. Let me know what you think. Anyways, have a wonderful day. Mr. Buzzsaw, signing out.